hey y'all what's up welcome back to another video i had to lay my edges down y'all on the way to work um so we are about to go on a trip um as you can see yeah we're about to go on a little trip well it's not a little trip it's a big trip um but it's super hot in here so i'm gonna be very very fast with you guys um so long story short i haven't worked in a few days i went i had to go to louisiana for my um friend's baby shower so i've just been off but i had a days which is reserve days if you're familiar or if you've heard it before um on my channel or any other channel flight attendant channel it's basically when you're on you're on call so whenever the company needs for operation needs that's basically what you're doing so i had three of those days ended up swapping with somebody it was a great swap that's that swap ended up me being off for three days so whenever i'm off um whenever i'm off i'm picking up something that i want to do you know what i'm saying so um and for me that's international trips so i want to go as many destinations I want to go to as many destinations as possible so um yeah for me that is international so i am on my way to milan italy and today is august 29th i am very excited because today marks my one year anniversary at my airline um so today's a very special day today also marks 18 years since Hurricane Katrina, which was the reason me and my family relocated to Atlanta, Georgia. So today has a lot of different meanings to it. Um, and I'm just so grateful to God that, you know, I, I'm alive. I just celebrated a birthday, like so many things to celebrate. I'm not crying, y'all. I'm sweating. <laughs> um, yeah, so many things to celebrate. But anywho, I'm really hot. My car, the AC is like not working. So I'm going to go get into go in there where there is some ac um so your girl don't pass out before her trip to milan because that wouldn't be cute so yeah i'm excited i'm gonna vlog this trip for you guys keep you guys posted make sure you follow me on instagram at underscore blessed is she underscore underscore and i'm gonna get more videos out to you guys i promise i promise i promise um yeah so we're gonna get out the car and i will talk to you guys later hey y'all oops so my flight's delayed a little bit well they should be here by now but it's still delayed because they have to do all the necessary things before we can get on the plane and we can board so I just came up to the gate and I'm like a few gates down. I have this little salad I got from the flight attendant lounge. So I'm gonna just eat a little bit of this because I had quite a bit of coffee. I did eat earlier a full meal, but I just, I'm just gonna eat something else because it is a kind of long flight. Um, so yeah, our flight is coming from Tokyo. So, well, it was coming from Tokyo, so it was delayed coming there, which is causing us to be delayed. So, no big deal. Um, so yeah, just want to give y'all an update. The next update I give you guys will be in Milan. So, I'll talk to y'all later. This is the salad I have. Nothing special. They put watermelon in it. I don't know. They wanted to garnish it with watermelon but yeah so look at this one um talk to y'all later so we went there and then uh we the east jet part of the cabin
Okay, guys, this is the hotel. We've arrived. This is a little tour. It wasn't a big room. This is the bathroom, as you can see. Um, there were slippers and a robe provided. This is the room. As I stated, it is not big at all as com in comparison to my room in Rome. Okay, that room was given. But it's cute. You know, it's still cute. Um... This next clip is the lobby when you walk in, which was simply gorgeous. It was everything was so large and big. I definitely took pictures because why not? Um, so, yeah. Here there is uh, two river uh -huh. and the small port. There is more. More, okay. Part, part, yes. More part, yes, yes, that's right. And uh, in this zone, there are a lot of uh, mm -hmm. restaurant, bar. Oh, yes, uh, this down here? Yeah. Back no, here, no, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the, the name is Navil. Navil. It's very nice in the night. In the uh, night? Yeah, okay. fr from 6 uh, o'clock uh, to the 2, two o'clock. Uh, there are some problems. Yeah, I'm from but, America, so yeah, we have a lot of problems. Yeah. <laughs> but normally... So I got a chance to visit the infamous QC Terme. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. In Milan, this spot is all over TikTok. It is one of the best spas I've ever been to in my life. And listen, I go to quite a bit of spas. Um, this is the Himalayan salt room. It was amazing. The idea of this spa is each room has a different setting, a different vibe, whatever you want. They have it. This room was like a thunderstorm kind of room. There was water coming from the ceiling. It was sea salt. It was a pool of water. Um, this next, next clip is me actually in it. It was, y'all, it was just something I've never experienced. If you're ever in Milan or at any of their locations, please be sure to visit the spa. Um, I paid for a five-hour access to the spa, and it was $79 and I think like 69 euros. So keep that in mind. It was amazing. Wow. Oh, so they're not like um
is cute. Don't okay. Okay, I'm making me a little. I always get magnets. Ooh, in Milan and I'm rushing of course um sorry you can only see a little bit but this is how the camera is yesterday a lot was going on we were delayed like almost two hours coming in, out of Atlanta which ended up delaying or decreasing our rest time here in Milan um but I made it to Milan as you all could see in the last snippets um Yesterday, I took a nap that I just didn't want to get out of. I was so tired. But I got up because I'd never been here and I wanted to explore. <clears throat> so, I took a nap and I just got up and left. Like, I got up and left. I went to the spa. Um, the spa that I had been wanting to try. And it just was like, this trip was so last minute. I had no plans on coming here. The day before, like, I picked this trip up the day before. It was set to leave so i didn't really have time out to plan anything so i kind of was just going off of like what's fun to do where's the good places to go because i did not know i didn't plan this trip i kind of just was like okay i'm gonna go to milan so here we are um yesterday was so amazing i ended up going to the spa as i mentioned you'll see all the pictures i'll do a voiceover so you guys can know more about that but um if you're ever in Milan, there's multiple locations. Um, this spa is like amazing. It is so insane. Like I want to go back today. Um, <laughs> if I could, I would. I want to go back today because it was just like, it was incredible. It was truly incredible. Um, <clears throat> I hope y'all can hear me. So yeah, it was really, really nice. It's called QC Termit. I think I'm pronouncing it wrong. I don't know. But that's what I did. That's where I went. Um, after that, I met up with my crew member. We went to what's called Dorme. It's downtown. Um, so we did that. We went to get some food. Um, also, we'll insert pictures. Food was amazing. What is the word? I don't know the word. Help me out, y'all. Help me out. I don't know. But <laughs> we did that. I got back like around... 11 last night <sighs> yeah 11 last night and we went i went out around 4 30 4 15 4 30 so i was out for a minute so y'all will see all the footage i am actually about to go have breakfast with my crew member we are delayed two and a half hours so yes i'm gonna go to the grocery store i'm kind of gonna do everything i wanted to do yesterday and today go to the grocery store get some things get some um food and different things like that and have breakfast and then i'm gonna come back take a little nap and then hopefully we'll be on our way back to the state so that's the only update i have for you guys um sorry i'm rushing i just yeah yesterday was a lot you when your time is reduced and you want to explore a city you kind of gotta consider rest napping when you first get back um, exploring that city and just also being well enough to go back and work because I'm working back I'm not you know sitting as a passenger after work so it is different and different things you have to consider um, you just have to prioritize certain things when that does happen or even when I if I would have had 24 hours I still would have to prioritize what I was going to do what I wasn't going to do um, just so I don't burn myself out so I'm about to go downstairs for breakfast. Um, I have on this little cute top I got from Micah's. Um, yeah, I'm still semi-asleep. 
I just showered. Cute little top, my favorite pants, these long pants, and my shoes. Y'all yeah, can't see. Oh, let me see. Maybe I can show you guys. Yeah, so hair, top, pants, shoes. You know, nothing too much. Y'all, they love my hair here. Oh my God. They're like, your hair is beautiful. So beautiful and long. I'll be like, thank you. Thank you, boo. But yeah. I'm about to head downstairs. I'll chat with you guys later. That's when if you want to have a... <laughs> oh my God. I don't know what that is. Oh wow, that funky building. Oh, no, he's so cool. No, oh, yeah. oh, wow. Ooh, some pasta sauce. Hey y'all, we're at the grocery store in Milan. Um, I'm trying to like trying different things without getting too much because I gotta carry it. So Yeah, I don't know what I'm looking for. Oh, this is some stuff I got. I'm gonna show y'all. I'm gonna do a little haul later, but I'm just trying to get this and go back so I can take a little nappy nap. I have paprika, paprika Pringles. They're trying to kill people out here. Okay guys, so I'm back home and able to do this um, really haul, quick haul to show y'all what I got from the grocery store in Milan. Um, I got these Nutella biscuits. They looked really good, so I just had to try them. These olives, um, I had some at the spa and they were really, really good, so I wanted some more. I got some pasta, of course. You can't go there without getting pasta. I got uh, some pasta sauce. I was going to get two of these, but I had to carry that stuff throughout the airport and stuff. So I didn't want my bag to be too heavy. Um, and then these are some snacks I grabbed from the plane. I also got some wine. This is a, a Giardino Santa Cristina Rosé. So this was so cheap. Um, FYI, wine in Europe, well, in Italy. It's very, very cheap, very affordable. You can find $5, $7 bottles of wine. Nice wine, good wine. So, and this is just a little treat they gave us at the hotel. So yeah, I didn't get that much stuff. Oh, oh my gosh, I almost forgot. These chips, as you can see, I already started eating them. Are the best chips I think I've ever had in my life. These original premium Japanese potato chips teriyaki flavor insane insane no like some of the best chips i ever had in my life they're so good so these are i should have gotten two bags i don't know if i would like them or not but i'm gonna see if i can find these like somewhere on the internet they are so delicious so good so yeah this is my little mini grocery haul Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, until next time.